Hi guys! So as you can see from the title of this video, this is going to be Birchbox for Ipsy. Now I did try to record this video already and my camera stopped working so I do know the products that I got but you know we're still gonna go through this. I still want to show you guys what I got in both of them and um, you know see which ones we like better. So I'm gonna start with my birch box. The box is really cute by the way. Um, I didn't get one of the curated boxes. I missed out on doing that so I just got you know one of the random ones. All right, so I'm just going to go down the list up and read off, you know, what I got. So first, I got this Amica dry shampoo. Um, it says this weightless spray in the brand's signature Oblifica scent that refreshes hair without residue. And I will say the scent is really nice, so I'm really excited to try this out. I always love trying out hair products. Okay. Next, I got a Kula Dage Dream SPF 30 Mineral Makeup Primer. Um, this silky antioxidant infused formula helps makeup stay put while blurring fine lines and minimizing pores. Um, so I did try this out on the back of my hand in the last video, and it doesn't feel as silky as other primers that I've used, but I'm still going to try it out, and I was saying I can see with the light coming in that there's only about this much product in there, which is really disappointing, but, you know, whatever. Still try it out. Alright. So, next is not that. <laughs> next is um, this MD Solar Sciences Mineral Moisture Defense SPF 50 for body. Um, this lightweight body SPF uses ceramides and humectants to restore skin's natural moisture barrier. Um, I'm always happy to try products with SPF in it because, as you can tell, I'm really pale and I burn after probably about 10 minutes in the sun, so this will be nice to try out. I mean, SPF 50? Nice. Okay. Next, I got a Moto Co lip lacquer, and it's in the shade Morocco, and it's actually on my lips right now. So this long-lasting gloss delivers rich, full pigment color paired with brilliant moisture and shine. Um, so it has a little bit of color. I definitely don't think it's really pigmented, but I don't know, maybe it's just this shade too. But I do like it. It's not sticky. It just feels really glossy and nice on my lips, so... I will definitely keep trying this out and using that. Okay, now last, I got this Vita Liberata Fabulous Self Tanning Gradual Lotion. This nourishing, hydrating, untinted lotion first applies clear, then develops co color over 48 hours. So that was my birch box. Um, wasn't too bad. I'm really excited about the dry shampoo, and I do like this lip lacquer too, so yeah, we'll see. Alright, so next up is Ipsy, and I just want to show you this postcard they sent. Usually the card I don't even like really look at because, you know, it doesn't give you information on the products, which I wish they did, but anyway, they sent this cute postcard that you can actually kind of fill out and mail, so I thought that was cute. Now, Let's talk about this bag for a second. I really love this because it has you know, this like snap here. They've always had like the zip one, so this is really cool. And I love the color too. Alright. So, first off, I got this Hikari um, Shimmer Bronzer. So, I don't really use bronzer. I don't know, bronzer scares me <laughs> a little bit. But I'm guessing this is like one of the ones where you swirl and, you know, bronze your face. So I'm just going to kind of swatch it. That's really shiny. I don't know. I don't know if that's right at all. You can let me know down below. <laughs> but the, pretty, the colors are really pretty. So I'll have to play with that a little more. 
All right. So next I got a um, Pacifica eyeshadow trio. Um, and they're all natural colors, so that's nice. So you got Skinny Dip. I think this is Crush and this is Lovely. So let me kind of swatch these. So that's the highlighting shade. And then right here is this darker brown. And then this lighter, it's kind of like a rosy brown color actually. So there we go. And their eyeshadows are really, I don't know, silky. So that'll be fun to try out. I mean, you can't go wrong with those colors. All right. Next, I got a um, antioxidant lip balm from the Organic Pharmacy, and it's made with shea butter and rose hip. Um, so I mean. This will be, you know, nice to use, and it's like a thicker formula. Um, I like that. It just makes me feel like it's actually working and like doing stuff to my lips. I don't know, because it's thicker, and I get really chapped lips, so this will be nice to try out. Um, next in here, I got a Smashbox. Um, mascara. And I did put it on this eye. So, I don't know. What do you think? I did like it. I need to try it out some more. Um, the brush is pretty nice, but it's not as... it doesn't comb through my lashes as well as I want it to, but it was the first time using it too, so I just need to practice with that a little more. And then last I got a perfume sample, which... Eh, I don't really care for perfume samples, but this one actually doesn't smell that bad. Um, it's from Remarkable People. I can't say the scent name. It's, I don't know, something with orange in it. But it does smell good, so I might actually use this. Um, yeah, it does smell pretty good. So there you go, guys. That was my Ipsy and my Birchbox. Which one do you think was better? I'm kind of thinking my Ipsy bag. I think I like that one better, but, you know, I did get some good products in my birch box, too. Alright, guys, um, let me know what you guys got in your boxes, and um, I will see you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.